Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're new here, my name is Shay Franklin. And don't forget to subscribe to the video. So, today I'm 33 weeks. Everything is the same. My stuff. Uh, I'm really uncomfortable. Like, I can't breathe. I have to sleep in different positions. But, you know, that's normal. So, uh, last Thursday, I had to go to the hospital because I was having pre, I think it's called preterm contraction. Anyway, I was having contractions, but I was having contractions last Thursday, real bad contractions, so I had to get shots. I think they call Celestial Stone. I think that's how you say it. I'm not for sure, but I will put the information in the video. But this is my first time ever having to ever have to take shots to stop labor, y'all. I was I wasn't dilated or anything. I didn't I never dilated, but I was having contractions at the tail. Do you hear me Thursday? No, Friday. So then that Saturday I had to get up, go back to the hospital. I had to take a steroid shot. Just because just in case if the baby decide to come, but today I'm I'm okay. I'm not feeling no symptoms. No uh cramping or none of that. I'm okay. I'm just a little bit tired because also Friday after I went through the whole contractions the I picked up Paris from the day from the day here. Baby, she been having a fever since Friday. Her fever started Friday. So then I took her to children's. I thought I'd go get my shot for her. Then I took her to children's. They told me they couldn't do nothing because she don't have any symptoms. No runny nose, no coughing, no nothing. She has nothing. So I just been having to give her I be profiting and telling no, her, baby, this this not working. Her fever, she have a high fever, and I just been trying to just keep keep giving keep giving her the medicine. Hope you all can hear me over the air. She feel okay now because I just gave her. She had a fever before we left. I took the other girls to daycare, and she had a fever before we left. But I um I gave her some medicine. Once I give her the medicine, it'll 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 work. But then a couple hours later, it'll wear off. Do I have to give it to her again? She not eating. I don't know. I thought maybe it was a ear infection, but it ain't. I don't know, y'all. But I'm just keep. I'm gonna go home and chain to the bell. So I'm gonna go home and make her take the bell. She has to take the bell because she's smelling really good. I really haven't really been too much bothering her because I know she didn't feel good. But baby, she gonna have to take a bath because she smells. But other than that, I'm not gonna be doing anything. I supposed to. I supposed to be having a baby shower tomorrow at work, but I don't think I'm doing it because if she's still sick, she probably have to miss a whole week of daycare. And I don't like telling the daycare nothing because and they be like, oh, well, your other kids can't go home, you know saying? And I don't be around a lot of people. I don't even go nowhere. The only time I go somewhere is if I go to excuse her hair. Oh, I want to show y'all my hair, so I did my hair. Um, I don't go nowhere unless I go to the doctor, the store, my grandfather. Yeah, I know I take care of my grandfather. Uh, my grandfather or the kids, they care the store in the doctor's office is, is, is where I be around a whole lot of people. Other than that, you girl be at home. I don't be around a lot of people because it's still, it's still stuff going around, you know. And it's probably just a... It's probably just a virus that's probably just gonna have to pass, but oh well, it's kind of hard on you, girl. Cause I'm eight months pregnant. Maybe if I want pregnant, it would be okay. But you girl, eight months pregnant, and it's it's it's, it's, it's hard. I ain't motherhood is hard, baby. It's 
takes a village to raise a child. Sometimes you don't always have a village. Sometimes it's just you. But I'll show you how the belly update in my hair and all this stuff. We get in the house. See ya. Hey y'all, so we just made it home. So I'm finna wash, I mean, take Paris to bed with him. Don't mind, I had washed some clothes yesterday. And I'm finna show you how the baby's been. So this. So this is the baby bun. You probably can't see it because I got a black dress. This is the baby bun. This is the baby bun. So right now I'm just going to take care of the baby bun. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm trying not to wear it because I am pre-turn. Pre- 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 I did have that pregnancy. Scary, you know, I don't, it's just, I don't want to let my baby come too early. I mean, it won't be early, but, I don't know. I'll be back later on to give y'all a update. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to show y'all my hurt. So this is my hair. I did these myself. I didn't do a I didn't do a tutorial or nothing. This is my first time. This is the color that I used to wear back in the day. But I just want to show y'all my hair. Comment down below. Thank you. Not, but Paris is doing okay. Her fever is, I don't know, but I think I'm taking her to the doctor tomorrow. Try to see if I can get some antibiotics for her or something, because some, some ain't going right for her to constantly be having a fever. And she, her nose just started running, so. Hopefully they can give me some antibiotics for her with them because, babe, we need that to go away because I got doctor's appointments and all that kind of stuff. But that's what it's giving, y'all. They feel much better at first. They hurt it, but they done loosened up a whole lot, but they don't hurt no more. So see y'all guys in the next video. Bye.